strictly Babola Jordan sizzles as she prepares for raunchy tour with husband James. The sexy pair promise their show Uncensored will be red hot and far more raunchy than anything you would ever see on the BBC programme. James teases, Lawton dancing is very sexy it's more sexy than what you see on Strictly. You will have the glitz and glamour but it's going to be more raw. It's not going to be a porno but I am known for being outrageous. We are quite naughty, aren't we? Adds Ola. On Strictly you can't be truly who you are James Jordan the pair are looking forward to letting go as they feel Strictly doesn't allow the pro dancers to show their true selves. James, who left the show three years ago, says, on Strictly you can't be truly who you are. I felt caged and like I wasn't able to be myself. I want to see the professional dancers have the personality. It's almost like the pro dancers are not allowed to have their own opinion. I like it when Brendan or Anton kick off or stand up for their partner it's boring to see nicey nicey all the time. I was one of the big characters, the naughty one. I wasn't scared to speak up, even on live TV. I miss that a little bit on the show now. The pair also reveal the pro dancers have far less input into routines now which could be why talented dancers such as Aston Marigold are getting the boot. James, 39, says. The last few years they have started changing a lot of things for the professional dancers which limits your artistic impression. We used to choose the music, we used to choose the costumes and all that sort of thing. It has changed. Veteran dancers Brendan Cole and Anton Dubik were tipped to join the judging panel after Lan Goodman's departure last year. Instead they lost out to Shirley Ballas, who has faced criticism for getting people's names wrong and controversially voting off Aston. But James and Ola are still hoping that the pro dancers will get their chance to become judges. 100 yes, says Ola, 35. I would definitely love to see Brendan and Anton on the panel. They deserve it, adds James. The show wouldn't be what it is if it wasn't for them. They deserve the recognition. Anton did a great job this year. The pair have also had spats with show judge Craig Revel Horwood, with James blasting Craig as not qualified to judge ballroom and Latin dancing. Honesty Craig has previously branded James as bitter which he insists isn't true. He says, people confuse my honesty with bitterness. I'm not bitter, I'm happy not to be on the show and let the younger ones do it. Ola adds, we don't really care what Craig's got to say. I don't really think about him anymore. 
The pair who have been together for 18 years and married for 14 also understand how the celebs and dancers can end up together. James says, you do form a really close bond and become really good friends. Dancing brings you closer, you get quite passionate. When you're in an office, you're not rubbing up your colleagues every day. But Ola believes it's less to do with the show than the state of people's relationships. She adds, if you're not happy in your marriage, you're not happy in your marriage. It will happen to anyone. The couple reckons the key to a happy marriage is being friends foremost and making time to appreciate each other. James says, we work with each other, we push each other. We're with each other all the time. But we don't take ourselves too seriously.